Hello traders, FX Pipcletti here. Today is Thursday, May 11th, and I'm going to be analyzing gold starting on the monthly, working my way down to the one hour time frame. So on the monthly, as you can see, we're still pushing up and we are approaching all time highs. I still think that this is uh, going to end up actually going up all the way at least to the 61.8 and maybe even a lot further than that. So let's take a look at that on the weekly time frame. And on the weekly, you really do have to kind of squish this down a little bit to fully understand where I'm coming from with this pattern. Because I see one up, which I think is a one, corrective down, which I believe is a two, and I still believe this is a wave three. A wave three needs to be bigger than a wave one projected out the bottom of wave two. So a wave three needs to go beyond 100% Fibonacci extension of wave one projected out the bottom of wave two, which means that this most likely is going to actually go up to all the way up to one of these higher Fibonacci levels, probably someplace between the $22 and $2,300 area to finish off this uptrend. So let's take a look at that on the daily time frame. Now on the daily time frame, I think this is a wave one. I think this is an ABC of two. And I still believe this is a series of higher highs, higher lows for a wave three. Now we have not broken any sorts into the downside. I still consider the trend is up. This level does represent all time highs. So we would expect to see some volatility, but I still think this is gonna go up. Probably gonna be some pretty good sized pullbacks along the way, but I do believe it will end up continuing to trend up. So let's head down to the four hour time frame. So on the four hour time frame, I still think this is an ABC correction right here. It went right to a Fibonacci level of this move up. And then this move up to me looks like a trend. I definitely see five waves. And as you'll notice, I do have my Fibonacci measure in this. And we've made three waves down right to the 50% level. We are already starting to make an impulsive move up. So it very easily could just keep on trending up from here. So let's take a closer look at that on the one hour time frame. One hour time frame, it's starting to look like a one, two, three, four, five right there. I think that's an uptrend. I think this is really the end of an ABC correction. You see one down, three up, and another down right to a Fibonacci level. So if this impulsive move up holds near its highs and turns into like an impulsive engulfing candle at the close, then I would definitely take that as a long opportunity because it very easily could make its way up towards these all time high levels before we do see another bigger pull back to the downside so don't forget to join my free discord channel the link for that is on the screen and in the description thanks and happy trading